guys, my name is Swifters, and as promised, I have for you all an exclusive Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies informational video. Now in my previous video, I told you guys that if we were able to smash out over 300 likes in 5 hours, I would be uploading today's video that you guys are viewing right now. However, we smashed out 300 likes in less than an hour. That is absolutely outstanding. Thank you guys so much. Now with that being said, let's try to bust out over 500 likes on today's video. That would be greatly appreciated. I know you guys can do it. And with all of that being said, let's get started. Alright guys, now this information is coming from a reliable source who has leaked a ton of things regarding Black Ops 3. Even so, this source has leaked a ton of things before the official announcement of Black Ops 3, and before we actually knew the official title of the next Call of Duty, and all of the things that he has leaked ultimately turned out to be true in all of the teasers and in all of the trailers that we did see for Black Ops 3. So that's why I am confident with this source, however I am not confirming anything in today's video, it is all leaks and speculations. So take from it what you will, and with all of that being said, let's jump right into today's video. Now the first thing that we're going to be taking a look at is the overall feel of zombies. Now according to this source, Cherik are sticking to the traditional route of zombies, however they are taking a more in-depth route this year in terms of the zombie storyline. Now although this source does not have specific details, he has listed some below which I will be reading off to you guys. As well as this in terms of the more in-depth feel, there will be several different cinematics during each map, some of these will be during the game, but most through easter eggs, which will give the zombie storyline a more campaign feel, as it will essentially be shown what and why specifically things are taking place. Next, we're going to be taking a look at the rumored Darice map making a return in Black Ops 3. Again, this is not confirmed, however it is coming from a reliable source. Darice will be making a return in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies, in which Samantha will be controlling the zombies and the four original characters will be returning. Not much information on the remake, however, several easter eggs will heavily focus on Edward Richtofen. Now that's pretty cool, I know a lot of people have speculated Darice to be coming back to Black Ops 3, it's a fan favorite map, so I do think that it would be really really cool to see this map get implemented into Black Ops 3, and if this does turn out to be true, I'm super excited to see how the map plays out. Moving on, we're going to be taking a look at the potential Chicago Zombies map that will be coming to Black Ops 3, and for those of you who have absolutely no idea how Chicago can even remotely be mentioned in the Zombies storyline, I will have a link down in the description below to a video that I posted a while back discussing Chicago as a next Zombies map. It's pretty epic, go ahead and click the link down in the description below. Now what the source says is Chicago, the setting of the map, not the map name. The second Call of Duty Black Ops 3 map will take place in Chicago after the events of Moon in which three rockets hit Earth. Although Richtofen's rockets did not disintegrate Earth entirely, the contaminant rockets, contaminated by element 115, gets into the Earth's atmosphere and creates havoc. The map is set far into the future of these events in which contaminated humans, now zombies, have caused destruction on humanity, infecting all those in their way. To fight against the zombies, humans have tried to exploit the powers of element 115 to create their own super soldiers which will not be infected by the zombies, as essentially they themselves are zombified, but the new super soldier will be able to still consciously think, obey commands, and have morals. Although the new super soldier program is working, the zombies are being brought to near extinction, however, no one could have predicted the following events. This new breed of zombies, super soldiers, has been brainwashed by a new leader, and the only thing that saved humanity is now their greatest threat. Now although we don't have much specifics on this potential Chicago Zombies map, we do know that Samantha will be heavily involved in this map and could potentially be a playable character. Keep in mind guys, as of right now, there are two separate storylines in the Zombies mode of Call of Duty Black Ops 3, at least that's what was said to us by Cherik. We're going to have a solely campaign mode of Zombies I guess you could say, and then the traditional Zombies storyline that we know and love, beginning all the way with Nocturne, Toten, Verruckt, Shinonuma, and of course, Doris. Moving on to the next map that we could potentially be seeing in Black Ops 3 Zombies, this map is called The Lost Temple. I'm super excited about it if it does turn out to be true, but according to the source, he says that he's not positive on which characters will be playable in this map, although it is believed to be the original four characters. This map has only recently been brought to life due to the overwhelming popularity and interest of mummy zombies in the Call of Duty community. 
Mummy Zombies has always been an idea within Treyarch Studios, however it never really got any true attention until now. This is expected to be shipped within the game, however it is also likely to come as part of a DLC package. It depends on the time completion. Now again, like the potential Chicago Zombies map, I have also posted a couple of videos discussing the next Zombies map in Cairo, Egypt, and that fits very, very well with this Lost Temple Zombies map. So if you guys like some additional information on that potential Egypt or the Pyramid Mummy Zombies map, go ahead and click the links down in the description below. So guys, that is all the information that I have for you in today's video. I do appreciate you all sticking around and listening to it, and even if all of this information doesn't turn out to be true, it was still pretty fun to fantasize and think about what we could potentially have in Black Ops 3 Zombies. So for those of you who enjoyed today's video, be sure to leave a like down below and also subscribe so you guys never miss a future Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video uploaded here on my channel. Let me know down in the comment section below what you guys thought about all of those leaks and speculations for the next Zombies map. Please be sure to let me know your thoughts about that down in the comment section below as I am extremely curious as to what you all think. But I'll catch you guys in the next video. And until next time guys, this has been Swifters. I'm out. Peace.